My name is Tommaso Ghidini. I'm the head of the materials technology section at the European Space Agency. The materials technology section is qualifying for space flight all materials and processes used to manufacture all ESA space missions. As a good example, to explain what we do every day, I can talk about the Solar Orbiter mission, flying to the Sun, going very close to it, 40 million kilometers from it, and having to be protected from the sun heat. So we had to de develop a sun shield, and all the instruments of the mission were sort of protected, like from an umbrella, underneath this huge sun shield. The, shun the sun shield being in titanium had to be coated with a black coat to protect the sun shield as well from the 500 degrees coming from the sun. And to do that, we were using a technology based on charred bones of animals, the same, exactly the same technology that the prehistoric men were using in their caves to paint the walls of the caves. Now, to me, it's really fascinating the fact that such an, an ancient technology used by prehistoric man is now used in one of the most sophisticated satellites that human beings ever built.